Hello, precious souls. Welcome to a twin flame journey. I'm Aura, and this is a podcast on twin flames. For more videos, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It is inevitable that we just desire to be with this person. We desire to live happily ever after and we want so much for everything to to just be perfect but attaching ourselves to the physical aspect of our twin flame is exactly what is holding us back from experiencing our own reunion after all it is a soul journey that we are experiencing not the idea of romance or the conditioned relationship that other souls will experience in their lifetime. But you are already becoming your twin flame and in a lot of ways with what you are experiencing with everything you are enduring. Time may be a serious factor in the human mind, but it is not. Your physical flesh ages, but your soul is always expanding and becoming. So when we attach ourselves to the details of what our reunion looks like, we focus on that instead of just allowing things to be. Attachments are all out of fear. That is why we struggle with letting go. We struggle with how our soul is speaking to us instead of just allowing the external to be as it is. Visibly, it looks as if our reunion is not occurring. As a result, there is this internal energetical alignment of lack, which will further delay it. Our soulful and energetical growth is what makes this journey what it is. Keep your peace flowing Keep your harmonizations going. Anything that costs you your peace is expensive. Anything that keeps you stuck in old vibrations or old habits, old ways of thinking will cost you your peace. Stay in the here and the now. You don't live in the past or the future. You are in your present. When you open your eyes, do you say to yourself, this is the day, this is the day that I'm going to soulfully live for myself and so much more because I'm becoming my twin flame. I am them. Every moment we spend attaching ourselves to the physicality of this journey is what makes or breaks us, but also realigns us towards our greatest accomplishments our blessings and our greatest gift to ourselves, which is letting go, letting go of the result, letting go of everything that we once knew was true, our beliefs, our values, and even a way of life. So letting your soul lead the way is what can reunite us once and for all. Our greatest gift is letting go of our human self guiding us, but allowing our soul to lead the way towards something that is bigger and better than ourselves. Don't attach yourself to something out of spite, out of worry, out of fear, but let go of all those things that can dictate your emotions or convince you of where you belong. You aren't in chains, but free on this soulful journey to choose yourself you, your twin flame. So I hope that this assisted many of you out there. Until next time, I'm Aura and this is a twin flame journey.